Hello, and welcome to my demo for the brain bug. You can think of this as basically controlling this, uh, this hex bug that we have here. I think it's called an inchworm. Uh, using these uh, infrared LEDs with this uh, Uno Ar Arduino board. And the, the direction and how we'll uh, decide to move, we'll use that by getting a serial data from this MindFlex that you have here. So uh, for the details into uh, tapping into that MindFlex, it's, uh, uh, I'm not going to go through it with this video because pictures are worth a lot more and uh, I'll have them all up on the website. Long story short, you can think of it as there, uh, there's a little label inside there and on the board saying RX and, uh, or, or sorry, TX on the board. And if you uh, grab that and ground, then you can tap into the serial communication present on the MindFlex basically the EEG values because it's a if you don't know the MindFlex is a, a brain toy so uh, it'll uh, collect your uh, your brainwave information and that's actually what we use to control this hex bug so uh, if I uh, get this uh, MindFlex guy and I put it on and then uh, after I get my ears plugged in If I ground myself, just to be safe, the, uh, not in the sense of brain waves, but in the sense of signal quality. Actually, doing this in the sense of brain waves is probably not very safe, but uh, it's a toy. I'm sure it's safe enough, and I haven't yet to even hurt myself. So if I turn, the, turn it on and let it uh, hopefully calibrate to me talking, and there we have it going. So let me quickly start the the serial monitor so that you can see what it's doing. And what you have here is you can see the, the different commands. And uh, I've moved the hex bug because since I'm talking, it's going to be sending a whole bunch of signals because I'm not concentrating and giving it uh, straightforward information. The, uh, the data you see there is the, uh, serial, the serial data that's received from the MindFlex. And uh, what I'm trying to do right now is wait a little bit until my averages catch up. Okay, now let's see if we have this. So if I focus and think, it should go forward, or from your point of view, to the left. And then if I relax, It comes back. So here I'll try it again. Forward, well, left. It's a lot harder than you think. <laughs> and then uh, release it again and it should go backwards. So there you go. All the details you need to make this for yourself are on my website at markjobos.com. And uh, this is uh, pretty straightforward. You don't need any, uh, any real parts besides LEDs. And I guess you have to solder a little, but it's not that hard. So I hope you enjoyed it.